welcome to my channel IT smart training today's video is on uh, AWS regions and uh, availability zones if my video is informative please like and share definitely subscribe my channel to get new technological video update which makes you IT smart so let's start the today's session <laughs> So AWS region and availability zone so at first we have to know that what is AWS region and availability zone in my previous uh, videos I already discussed about the regions and availability zone so once again I just briefly describe the AWS regions and availability zone AWS region is a geographical location as you know that with a collection of availability zone mapped to a physical data center in the region so if I uh, this is my AWS Amazon Web Service is Amazon Web Service there are several kind of reason AWS regions is basically a geographical location suppose India Mumbai this is a geographical locations in the geographical location is called region inside this geographical locations there is uh, uh, two or more availability zones are there availability zone nothing but a data, data center where the AWS uh, servers are resides so this is my Amazon web service uh, service uh, and inside the Amazon web service there is uh, one region and two region inside the region you can see that availability zone is there so availability zone is basically uh, are nothing but a data center so an availability zone is a logical data center which I've already mentioned in a regions available for use by the AWS customer each zone in a regions has a redundant separate power networking and connectivity to reduce the likelihood of two zones failing simultaneously if my two zones are failing simultaneously the third zone will be uh, take responsibility uh, all of the uh, all of our data and VMs and all these things one common misconception is that is a single zone equals to a single data center okay in fact each zone is backed by one or more physical data center so if each zone there is a more physical data centers are there okay so now I just go to the AWS console so this is the AWS console of IT smart training here we can see that the regions is shown there these all are the regions these regions are the geographical locations where the data center resides okay so this is the regions I can select suppose I just select um, a data uh, a region which is Asia specific uh, Mumbai I just select these regions and then I just select EC2 I just want to show you the uh, availability zones over here if I drop down we can see there are three availability zones are there AP South 1A AP South 1B AP South 1C and I select another data another regions over here like uh, US West and just I go drop down there you can see that the two availability zones are there US West 1B US West 1C and select another one
here you can see that us east 1a 1b 1c 1d 1e 1f these all are the availability zones are uh, here here i'm just uh, find aws regions here you can show global infrastructure link i just open the global infrastructure link here you can see the regions and its uh, availability zones over here this is uh, south africa this is europe if i select regions here is you can see the regions definitions is over here and it, here it, the availability zones informations is over here So this is the map where the availability zones informations are information are there you can see these all are the availability zones and the regions so if my video is informative please like the video and subscribe the channel thank you see you on the next video